Winter is upon us, and with colder, wetter weather comes more treacherous road conditions. Clark County Public Works, along with other local agencies, held a press conference on December 7th at the City of Vancouver's Operations Center in Vancouver about keeping residents safe on the roads this winter season. We've got all the equipment tuned up and ready to go, so uh, we're ready for weather when it occurs. Uh, once we get um, a weather report indicating we might get weather, then we'll, uh, if it's ice conditions, we'll generally go out and pre-treat the roads so that the ice that may come down doesn't bond with the road and gives us a head start on the uh, response. Clark County and the City of Vancouver strive towards keeping primary and secondary roadways clear for commuters. Washington Department of Transportation is responsible for keeping highways and freeways such as I-5, SR-14 and SR-500 safe for public travel. We monitor NOAA's uh, weather forecast so that we make sure that we have crews available and at the ready. Um, we'll make sure trucks are loaded uh, with either mag or uh, salt. Um, we pre-treat when possible. Uh, if it's not raining, we can put down some mag chloride and get a good pre-treat on there first. Um, otherwise, we just dispatch people out to our priority routes and um, treat the roads as necessary. Another agency focused on public safety is C-TRAN. Buses are equipped with chains as needed and drivers on alert if road conditions become a concern. Almost all of our fixed route vehicles in the C-TRAN fleet are equipped with what are called drop-down chains. Those are essentially automatic chains that actually deploy underneath the bus at the push of a button. So the operator of the bus can deploy those while on route and, and not have to get out of the vehicle or anything like that. It's, it's a very seamless um, and it's a very effective tool to, for, for getting through winter events. If anybody's out traveling uh, in a winter weather event, we certainly recommend that they dress for conditions, uh, be prepared to uh, allow for a little extra time to make their trip. C-TREN also has a number of routes that have designated snow routes, so we really encourage folks to know what those snow routes are before they head out. If you are driving in winter conditions and your vehicle gets stuck, please do not abandon your vehicle. If you have a phone with you, call 911, turn on emergency flashers, and wait for help to arrive. Make sure your car is ready, it's fully fueled or fully charged, and then make sure you've got some things in your car. If you, if you somehow do get stranded, um, make sure you've got extra water, uh, some snacks, uh, something to keep yourself warm, a blanket or extra clothing. Um, make sure your cell phone's charged. Um, you just never know how long you're going to be there and, and what, what you're going to be up against. So try to just make sure you've got some things that are there to keep you safe. Um, stay with your vehicle and, 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 try and try and get yourself you know, unstuck. We get a lot of folks who just abandon their vehicle. And the problem there is now we've got a vehicle that's sometimes in the middle of the street that we've got to work around. There's not really much to do other than be patient because we can't plow fast. Uh, we need to do a good job safely and that's just a slow process. But we do it frequently, which, ho which helps us um, not have to do as much each time. So because we continue to treat during the course of the day, things don't pile up on us and it makes it manageable. For more information about safe travel and road conditions, Contact Clark County Public Works at 564-397-2446 or at clark.wa.gov slash public works. The City of Vancouver at cityofvancouver.us slash severe weather. ctran.com and the Washington Department of Transportation at wsdot.wa.gov.